Yo, how's it going, guys? Shogun Raids here, and today we are back on the treasure wall server for another episode of action. So, today, guys, I actually want to head to the war zone because ever since we got golden knife, I haven't stepped a single foot into the war zone. And this guy over here, man, I don't know what he's doing, waiting for me to jump down or something. So, yeah, I actually just want to head into war zone, maybe get a few kills and stuff, and possibly even kill a few people that have gear I could work off. And if anybody's here that we can actually take a piece of the actual god set from, that'd be sick to you. So yeah, I actually just need a helmet because, well as you guys know, I don't have another helmet. While I was working on one, we actually got knifed and I guess I had to use my knife to get another helmet, which you guys already, which I already told you guys about last episode. So yeah, either way, we still do need a new helmet, which kind of sucks and hopefully right now we can go ahead and grab that though. So, I need to actually use my fly. So yeah, let's see what's up under here. I think this is still human spawn. Wait, what race am I? I am probably human. Yeah, I actually have no clue. I might be a dwarf, but I know I'm not an elf. So yeah, I'm still under human spawn. That was pretty stupid. But yeah, let's just carry on going through here. And I actually turned my chat down because there was a lot of spam earlier. So I just kept it down because it's getting in the way of the actual screen. So that's the reason why you can hardly see it right now. But we can still write commands and all that good stuff. And if I ever like, turn my fly on, then I can not see it in the chat. Or I can see when my when I'm out of combat, so that's still good. Let's see, I'll turn it up by next episode again. So let's see what's up here. And I've got oh my god, dude, 10k. And I think that was the guy that I just freaking jumped down off of. I think that was the guy that was waiting for me there. So I actually jumped down and then I flew back up and he was just waiting for me the whole time. And I didn't know he was still there. I was like, bro, please. So yeah, let's see what's up. Uh, these chests are unlooted as well. Hopefully someone is actually in the wars and that we could fight. If I see him again, I might want to try and kill him, but then I don't want to be that guy. Because he actually just gave me 15k, which is basically nothing anyway, but I don't know. He gave me a gift, I don't really want to hurt him, so if he attacks me, then we will kill him though. That's the thing. So yeah, let me head to Necro right now. Necro is minus 45, minus 45, or 45, 45, or something like that, either way. Yeah, I know which way it is, so we'll run into it anyway. So it should be down somewhere over here. Okay, nope, it's nowhere near here. I think it could be somewhere over... Um, I'm completely losing track here. I think it might be this way, actually. Yeah, it definitely should be this way, and I'm getting a bit of turbulence. I think it's the server, because I was having this earlier as well. And we've got one guy already. He's a human, but I can't really attack him. And then I think he's running away from a guy down here. We've got, who is this? We've got, no, I don't want to stay near, actually, you know what, let's jump this guy. Let's see what we can do. Okay, yo, this guy has a max set, by the way. Let's see what we can do any damage to him. He might try to run away and TP his friends in, which wouldn't be too good for us, because, I don't know, his, these are the guys that actually ganked me the other day. They go to knife me in my freaking set, which kind of sucked. And I don't know, he might be trying to bring his friends over right now, so I might not want to actually try and fight him here. Looks like he actually ran away then. I actually been waiting here for a little bit, just seeing if he'd come back. But I think he actually just legit just went away from here. He might actually come back with a few of his friends. Let me actually check if any of their faction members are online right now. We've got him and another guy. So yeah, that's Luchi's type guy. He also has a max set, so I might not want to actually go for them there. Because I don't want to get 2v1 right now. I'd prefer to keep my set on me. I don't really want to lose this. So yeah, right now I'm actually not going to do anything about that. I'll stay away from Necro, but I'll go, I'll go back there in a little bit. If I'm not getting any actual PvP, and if they're all both still there, then I might try to call a few allies or something, because I know a few of them are online right now, which is definitely sick. So yeah, let's see if anyone is still here. So let me just, I need to stop freaking walking on the land. I have fly, dude. I, need, I just keep forgetting to use this. So it's pointless just walking. So yeah, we've got one guy over here. He's a human and he has basically nothing on, so I don't want to go for him. And uh, let's see, is there anyone else around here that we could potentially go for? Let's see this chest actually. It has a kill streak 6. And obviously it has nothing to do. But yeah, hopefully someone is around here. Because I do want to try and jump on someone. Okay, yeah, we've got... Alright, yeah, so let's just carry on going down here then. Hopefully there are still a few people maybe just hanging around here because... Yeah, this looks like it's completely empty right now. I do want to do a sick freaking run through the walls and maybe kill a lot of people. But it doesn't look like anyone's even here right now, which kind of freaking sucks, dude. But, I don't know, it's always like this. Maybe we'll go to Nether, actually. Let's see what's up at Nether. I might actually want to do a bit of PvP there. I guess it's mostly for fun because you can't really kill anybody there. But either way, if I'm getting nothing here, then I might as well. And see, dude, there's always so many people here. So yeah, let's jump out all the way here. We've got Freestyle here. Our boy freaking Freestyle. Uh, we've got Jay Johnstone, 
Okay, I don't know who these guys are, but they're probably friends of these guys there. And I'm going to kill him anyway, so. Let's see what's up. Uh, it doesn't look like anyone's really running towards us right now, which is kind of weird. Okay, we've got Fruni over here, but he's truced as well to us, I believe. Yeah, he should be, and I think he's human anyway. Or he might actually even be able to attack humans in this land over here. Maybe that's only in the woods and outside of spawn. I kind of, yeah, you can actually attack them. Yeah, I already knew that, but I guess I was just confirming it there. So yeah, hopefully someone runs out. I'm actually going to write in chat. Slash walk. Uh, FCP. I can't. My keyboard is placed really weird right now because I have my mics like placed right in front of me, which kind of hurts my head. But I need to move it later on when I get my stand fixed because I don't know how to use it right now. I'll get it fixed by next episode maybe because I said that last episode as well, so I'm not gonna say for sure. But yeah, my typing's gonna be a really off. So yeah, this guy's over. He's he's a truce as well. So looks like everyone that's not truce doesn't want to run out right now. That guy is truce as well. Let's see, let me kill this guy over here. Oh my. <laughs> yeah, that was sick, dude. He just got freaking. I don't even know who killed him there. There was like so many people jumping onto him. So, yeah, someone fliss. Just come out, dude. Uh, let me write it once again. Uh, yeah, so hopefully now people will actually come because I just put it in chat. So now I don't know there's actually stuff going down at Nether right now. So, yeah, I've got, I know a few people in that crowd there, so I might not want to kill everybody. So I'll kill that guy there. Easy kill, dude. Easy kill. So yeah, he's got freaking, he's got a wooden plank on him as well. And then we've got VVW here. Okay, yeah, I might want to actually put my iron golem on right now. So yeah, let's jump on this guy. We've got him down to 30 something worse than here. That was nice. And now he's got us all the way up in the air with an eye elite. That is definitely good, alright? So yeah, let me just jump back onto him. Yeah, let's see how this goes. And holy crap, dude, he's dealing some damage onto me. I might want to actually play this slightly more safe because I don't know he may have his friends around here as well I know I do have a few of my truces but I don't know he might even bring someone with a golden knife which would freaking suck because I know these guys have multiple they have more than one knife so yeah I'm getting him down but I know he's gonna jump back into the safe zone and then he brings his wait I think I was attacking the wrong guy what was that I just saw another that's freestyle there I don't know what's going on here this guy here, VV, is almost dead. This dude is almost dead. Dude. Yo, where did you go? Yo, get this guy. He might actually try to run back. I know he has this set on him. Yo, dude. If we can kill him right now, I freaking nether. That'd be sick. That'd be really sick. Yo, let me actually gap up real quick. Yo, we actually got him super down. I think he's running. Yeah, he's here, dude. He's at 20 and he's not actually retreating, which is kind of weird. Cause I know this guy and he's always freaking running unless he has his whole squad with him. Alright yeah, it looks like he's just sitting back next to the, I guess, safe zone part of the walls in here. Which kind of sucks. I don't know, maybe they should actually change it. But I don't know why I keep complaining about it because I know nothing's going to happen. If you come here then you have to be prepared for that. See, so yeah, I'm just going to run back in and quickly fix up my set. I should probably start from the top actually. So yeah, let's go out like this because I do have blessed tree on my helmet and I need that to be... I need to put on my boots last so that, but the blessed three overwrites my blessed two there. So yeah, let's just do that. I'll fix up my axe just because I want to throw this crap out. Restock my ender pose there, and there you go. So that's actually what I do every time I go into wars in or whatever. Yeah, I just need to make sure that I maximize my chances of actually surviving, because, hey, as you guys know, I really don't want to die. And I've got all of my allies here as well, which is freaking sick. I'm just going to kill these guys for the fun of it. Dreamy is actually in the ally faction, so I can't do anything to him. And we've got Zinder here as well. I don't know who he is, but okay, yeah, it looks like he grabbed the note there, meaning he got the kill. So, yeah, let me actually check. Is my fly? Yeah, I'm in combat, so now we're not in combat. And he's back, dude. He's freaking back. What a guy, dude. He's gonna run back anyway, but it's still kind of fun that we could actually potentially, with this many people, get two shots into him and actually kill him. Yeah, it does look like he's taking so much damage, dude. This is sick. Yeah, hopefully we can get enough hits into him to make him actually drop all the way down. And yeah, he's ran back in already. That kind of sucks, but it's whatever, dude. Uh, we still got the whole squad here as well. So I guess we're kind of controlling the warp nether area right now. And dude, he's so low. He's legit so low. I don't know why he keeps coming back. I don't know if he has a god set on or what. That's so weird. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna actually gonna carry on jumping onto him. Dude, it's so loud right now. I can't hear anything. Holy crap, dude. And this guy is dropping. Absolutely dropping, dude. That is nice. That is really nice. So, yeah, let me actually jump back onto him. He's on 20-something. Let me actually lead him out of here. Actually, let me try run and see if these guys follow me. 
Cause hold the cat, maybe I can fake being low and then they'll come further out into the nether make, me, Making sure that they don't actually run back in I've got JJ here as well, and dude, this guy just got knocked all the way. Here we go then, so we are back here, we've got Vandals just running trust for no reason. And then we've got the boy, get drilled. He's in the truce faction as well, so we can't do anything to him. Same with Fruity, and it looks like everyone else is chilling back here in the safe zone area, which kind of sucks for us, but I don't know, maybe we can head back to the actual war zone in a little bit if we aren't getting any action here. So yeah, here we go, this guy just got smacked all the way back. Then we've got our boy Sahil, I have no clue who this guy is. Yeah, I need to quickly jump back and here we go they're all jumping out now so maybe I should actually kill these guys over here because they might get in the way when we're actually fighting and this guy is cancelling dual request wait what happened okay I think he dueled me so when I hit him it's self a dual thing I'm not sure what's going on there so yeah maybe that's a glitch or something or maybe I was just stupid and I wasn't paying attention so yeah let's see what's up We've still got... Yeah, it doesn't look like anyone's really coming out. There was this one guy who just jumped down and killed me and then he ran back. But other than that, it doesn't really look like anyone's trying to fight right now. So, yeah, I don't... Yeah, let me just get out of here. Let's go to spawn. And then let's jump into the actual part of the war zone. And then from there, we can see if we find any people. And if we don't, then we'll return here. Because this is actually a really good place to PvP. I actually enjoyed that. I might actually come back here more often. Every PvP episode, I might just do half of it over here and then the other half in the war zone. Alright, so here we are. Back into the actual war zone right now. Hopefully there are a few more people here. And if there isn't, then we'll head back to Nether because that was definitely intense. I understand why people go there now. I keep, I'm just repeating myself right now, but I actually do understand why people go there now. It was definitely worth the while because I guess there is a chance you can kill them as well, and there's still actually combat there. So yeah, and this guy just said I'm in the war zone, so people might actually come now. I don't know. But yeah, that's a bad thing. I don't really want to tell people I'm in war zone because that also encourages factions to come after me. So that isn't too good because I don't want to get guy. Right, yeah, so I just found bannable PvP. I do know this guy has something. It might not be this guy actually. I think it's someone with a similar. Yeah, it's probably not this guy. I was about to say he has a max set, but this guy, he got killed really easily. I don't know what was up with that. It's probably someone with. See, I'm actually on Nick right now, and there's a lot of humans here. It doesn't look like anyone else is here because I think humans have control of it right now, and our allies are also in the war zone, meaning we probably have control of the war zone too. Considering there's nobody else that I can see right now. See, I'm just going to carry on running through here. Let me just turn my fly on. Yeah, let's check this out. Hopefully, we can kill a few people. That guy we killed earlier, probably, well, I guess he definitely didn't have any good gear on him. And I might actually want to rename my set as well. I just realized that I actually renamed this helmet to knife because, and I just found it funny because we got the kill from a knife. And by the kill, we actually got the gear from. Yeah, it definitely doesn't look like anybody's in the war zone right now, which kind of sucks. I might actually go back to Warp Nether because that was probably more entertaining, and I even found that way more fun. See, I'm heading back to Warp Nether. Hopefully, there are. Holy crap, that's freaking loud. Ouch. That was freaking loud. Let me just go there and I'll put my sound back on. Holy, I kind of hurt my ear there. So yeah, let me just go here. I don't even know what that sound is, and it looks like Warp Nether is also cleared out, apart from this guy over here. Dude, come back dude, Wait, we've got freestyle there, that's not freestyle, that's Johnston. And it looks like it'll probably be a fair fight now as well, consider, okay that's not a fair fight. We've got three of those people here, and then we've got two of us, and then my boy freestyle is still down there as well. Not freestyle, my boy Jay is still down there. So it actually does look like Warp Nether cleared out, because everybody's getting out of there right now. Maybe they're entering the war zone, because I do know some of them came here, like Freestyle and the rest of the allies. So hopefully some other people are here too, that we can actually fight. Because the few people that were actually at Nether were the people that were trying to gank me, and they both had max sets. So I don't know, if there was any one of them, then I probably would have actually stayed and tried to 1v1 him. And I don't know, maybe even tried to pop him. Cause if I got low and I tried to run, I could probably run really far out of the warp nether area and then maybe he'd chase me and then we could fight there. And if I ended up killing him then I could actually take his set which would have been sick but yeah I don't know. Looks like it's clearing out there. So let me just turn my fly on, there we go. And here we go to warp, we're well, not warp, let's go to necro so that should be. Okay we've got magma here as well, that is sick. I'm actually going to fight this then. Alright yeah, let's go. I don't know who's around here though so hopefully we don't have any really OP people. We've got Matty something over there. I don't know who that is. And it looks like he might even be the only one over here, which is freaking sick, dude. So yeah, I'm actually going to stay here then, because maybe we could actually grab something nice out of this. Hopefully we can grab every rift we can do, because then we can go ahead and redeem that right at shop to grab the freaking mythic key. And I don't know where this guy is gone. Yo, dude, he's dead. Nope, 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 nope. Yo, where is it? Where are the rift tokens, dude? 
Yo, I don't see them. This is not good. Oh my god, you have to be joking. Did I actually not get them? Because I'm literally right here. The other guy can't have claimed them because he's nowhere near me. Where is where are the rift tokens, dude? Oh dude, you have to be joking. I can't believe imagine if I just ran by it then you guys saw it and I'm just stupid, but I don't see any rift tokens. See, I'm actually just gonna go around and try pick up as many things as I can. Cause yeah, I got my mythic crate, but I don't see any rift tokens. See, he definitely died over here. I saw him die. I think I got the final hit as well. Or the guy next to me got the final boo hit, which freaking dude, don't even joke around. Is that really it? Yeah, it looks like that's freaking it, dude. Oh my god. Oh, that was dumb. Maybe he died up here, actually. Could we actually check this out? Maybe he walked back up here, or maybe he actually walked somewhere around here. I don't know where it went. Okay, that's just freaking stupid, man. I don't... Yeah, whatever, dude. I'm not even going to complain. That's just how it works, I guess. So I'm going to open this here, because I do know nobody here is going to try and kill me right now. So we don't really have anything to lose. So... Okay, that was. I'm still kind of salty about that actually, because I really wanted to open that mythic key, and then we've got Sly Fox here as well. Let me just check this guy's faction real quick. Um, he's in the ally faction. He's in Envious, so that is good. So yeah, let me check this out then. Uh, maybe he actually picked it up. I don't know. So wait, I'm just taking one final glance. This isn't okay, man. This is not freaking okay, dude. Oh, I don't think. Yeah, we probably. Yeah, we missed out. It's whatever, man. Maybe I ran over it, and I'm just stupid. But either way, it's no point me staying there, cause. I'm literally just gonna go over the same thing. But yeah. Let me we've got an elf down here at Necro and we've got okay, no, we're not coming over here. Yeah, dude, we've got Shorty here as well. So I should probably stay here and try and see what I can do to this guy here. Oh yeah, look. So hopefully he doesn't bring his friend with him as well. And I think they're communicating there because I saw the VV guy here as well. And then we've got our boy Shorty helping us out too. So that is definitely good. And I don't know how he just Yo, that was a really lucky call. I don't know how he did that there. I think I just threw mine and it failed. I don't know. And I've got VV here as well, which is sick as well. So yeah, let me just come on, help this guy out. Because I can't let my boy Freestyle die here. Not my boy Freestyle, my boy Shorty and Free. Because I think Free's coming in a bit as well. He's always coming when I'm freaking in the war zone. Because he knows, and he doesn't want me to die, dude. That's a poor legend. But yeah, that's besides the point here. Let me just freaking... Okay, let me get my skull split on on this guy, and I've already used it, it looks like, so I can't use it there. And I really wish I had my Valentine's pet still, but we can't really do anything about that. And yo, there's so many of them, we're getting out of here. Yeah, we're getting out of here. This is not our day. This is not our day, dude. Not our freaking day. And I think he's gonna pull on me to keep me combat tagged, which isn't good at all. He might try to pull next to me. So yeah, I need to quickly gap up real quick. And then we've got, I don't know who that is, but I think someone's saving me there. And they got petrified, what was that luck? Okay, no, this isn't good. And there we go, our power landed finally. See, I need to get out of it, this isn't good. I saw bro in that bro, bro in that bro as well. Okay, yeah, this isn't good for us at all. And they were all behind me, dude, what are you guys doing? And he just got a hit, nice. Alright, yeah, I need to get out of here. Hopefully we did have a derp. Uh, hopefully we do have a derp somewhere around here because I know the chords to it and I think it should be straight from here. Well, it's not my derp, but it's a friend's derp, but hopefully he accessed me to it, so meaning I can actually come in there. So yeah, let me actually pull out of here, this isn't good for me. I don't know why he just jumped in with me. Okay, yeah, no, that is not good at all. <laughs> my pole, where is it gone? Land, dude. Okay, my pole isn't landing. Oh my god, I might actually die here. I don't know what the hell that was. What that was my glitch power that cost me my freaking gear. Don't cost me my gear, dude. Okay, I need to get out of here. This isn't good. So yeah. Oh, we've got my wolves there to help me. So yeah, I should pull up down there. And I want to hit this guy over here. Oh my god, you have to be joking. And I need to fix my helmet as well. So let me just quickly take that off and fix. And this guy, I'm getting freaking ganked right now. This isn't holy crap, dude. That was freaking insane. I just fixed up my game. My boots were about to break. I just got in here. I just got out of combat. And I quickly flew to this human spawn here. That was intense, dude. That was literally intense. Holy crap. Because they were still looking for me. And I was right behind them. And they went the other way. So I was so happy. But then my power failed again. So I was hoping they wouldn't turn around. And then they actually didn't turn around, which was sick. I don't know. Maybe they were doing near. And they just didn't know how to use it or something. Because... Holy crap, that was a really clutch escape, because if they got like, i say, three or four more hits on me, I would have actually died there. Well, not died, my boots would have popped there, and then that would have actually led me to die, or 
So I might actually take some allies with me next episode because holy crap, dude, I actually want to go to wars and maybe kill like another faction with people that I can properly communicate with because when I'm actually typing to these guys in chat and right there, my opacity was all the way down as well. So I could hardly see anything. So that was absolutely horrible. So next time around, I might actually go to them on team speak, maybe talk to them while we actually fight because that way we can properly communicate and then I guess the chances of us actually killing someone will greatly increase. So I think I'm going to wrap up the episode here, guys. So if you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, everyone.